Hello friends, welcome to an experiment. So I am starting a journey. A journey of the brow and the lash. <laughs> I am going to use a new Christmas present that I got. The Grande Brow Growth Serum and the Grande Lash Growth Serum to help make my eyebrows thicker and my lashes longer. I'm going to use these products every single day for a month and see what happens. See if my brows grow, see if my eyelashes grow, and let you guys in on the results. I have used Grande Brow before and it's really helped grow in um, the more sparse areas of my brows. You can see before I used it, and I used it probably six months ago maybe, um, but I had no undergrowth on my brows. So you can see where it's already helped, but I haven't used it in, oh gosh, probably three to four months. And it's really a product that you have to use every day to keep getting the results that you want. I'm excited to use the Grande Lash Serum for the first time to try to make my lashes longer. So this is how I'm starting. I have done my makeup for today, but I purposefully did not do my eyebrows yet. I'm going to show you my eyebrows totally all natural like they are now, and then I'm going to show you what they look like filled in on day one. Same with my mascara, except for I've forgot and already put mascara on so sorry but um, I'm gonna show you what it looks like natural and filled in and give you updates until we see if this freaking product works and it's worth it because it is expensive that's for dang sure so without further ado let's look at what I'm starting with here so I just did my eyebrows I plucked them I plucked all the extras and I am hoping to get this way more filled in I just think it looks so sparse and maybe even a little bit up here too. And then my lashes, I've always been really happy with the length of my lashes. So I'm just excited to see like, is it going to make me look like I have lash extensions? I'm just excited to kind of experiment and see how far they'll grow. So this is where I'm currently at with mascara. But I'm excited to try. Let's put it on. Okay, first up is Grande Brow. So this you just apply wherever you want it to fill in on your brows. So I'm just going to put it all down here on this lower brow line. And then I'm going to also put it just a little bit through too, because I mean, it's not going to hurt to fill in what's already looking good. And I'm going to do it on the other side. It's easy as that. So, okay. Now for the eyelash one, since I've never used it before, I'm once I read the instructions, I realized I probably should not have put makeup on first, but you know what? It's okay. So it says you just apply one thin stroke like you're applying liquid eyeliner to the base of your eyelid. So, whoa, we're going to do it. There's one, not sure how good it's going to work this first time since I'm doing it over eyeliner. Probably shouldn't be doing that, but, you know, you live and you learn, am I right? Okay, that was more than just one stroke, but, you know, I wonder what happens if I get it in my eye. That's probably not good. Okay, well, it's easy as that. Day one, done. Okay, and this is what my brows look like week one filled in. So I just kind of fill in the lower areas and that's it. Hey, Scramp. Hey. Hello, friends. Okay, so it's been over a month. I know I said I'd check in every week, but I just wasn't seeing enough progress every single week, and so I thought it would be boring to show. But it's been just a little bit over a month, like a, a month and a couple of days, and I'm finally starting to notice some progress. Okay, let me show you up close and personal. So this side it's definitely getting more growth, especially under here. I just need it to fill in in like this little spot. And then over here is growing in. I don't know if you can see, but these little hairs are so freaking long over here. They were not there before. Um, but so I want it to fill in. There's a little like, um, sorry, my hand is kind of shaky. I just worked out. Frick. Um, there's a little dead spot that just like won't, nothing will grow right here. So I just want it to grow. But I'm actually very like pleasantly surprised by how it's coming along. Do you like this shot? 
So, and eyelashes, I haven't noticed that big of a difference, but my eyelashes are usually pretty long anyway, and I think they definitely have grown. I don't really think there's a way for you to tell. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put my stuff on, let it dry like I do every day, but then I'm going to put some, I'm going to do my brows and I'm going to do my mascara. So at least you can see with makeup on how much different they look. And then I'm going to take shots to show you comparison for this first check-in. I think we're going to probably go to two or three months. This might be a really long stretch of a video. Now that I've got makeup on, I can tell that it's even more stark. So by the way, I just got out of the shower because I just worked out. So that's why my hair is wet. I didn't say that at the beginning, but um, I can totally tell that both my brows, especially my brows and my um, eyelashes have grown and filled in. This brow is giving me a little bit of issue just because of that dead spot that I was talking about. So like these two are super long right here. And they don't connect as well. Hey, Scrimpy. Hello. I'm filming um, an update on my eyebrow nice. eye thing. They look great. Thanks. Can I help you? Do you want to have dinner, Rosa Lucy? Yes, I do. Love you. So I'm very pleasantly surprised. I didn't think it would be this dramatic of a difference after just a month but I can totally tell so now that I've got makeup on my face let me show you and this isn't my full face I literally just put on mascara and eyebrows but let me show you side by side from the very beginning month one when I had makeup on and now um isn't that change just like so insane I am so excited to see next month where I'm at, I want big bushy brows. And my eyelashes, I really didn't think they had changed much, but you can definitely tell that they've grown. And I think they've gotten more full as well. Um, sorry, I keep looking at myself to remember what I want to say about it, but they really do look more full, I think. So totally works. I, I love it. It's great. Okay, you guys. So it's maybe two or three or maybe even a month. Eh, probably not a full month, but it's a couple of weeks later since I gave you my last update. And yes, I know I look crazy because I have one brow done and one brow not done, <laughs> but I wanted to show you an update. So these are my brows, all natural. You can see they're really growing in right here. This is the brow that a couple of weeks ago had, um, a spot that wouldn't grow that spot has started to grow so it's filling in really good down here which I'm happy about so I'm just kind of ready for it to fill in right here so it definitely has a lot more hair there you go you can see it better with that light and so really I just need for like right here to grow in and then this to just get thicker but I'm really happy with the progress there and look it's starting to take more of the shape that I want I could even draw this down a little bit more but I don't want to um so it's definitely thicker it's definitely working I'm obsessed okay and then for my lashes here are my lashes totally um all natural let me put mascara on because that's when you can see how it's really changed and then I'll show you the progress between the last update photo I gave you and this one. Oh my gosh this is so exciting it's actually freaking working I'm loving it oh my gosh you guys my lashes are so long I am like shocked and amazed wow I just keep like looking at them in the camera okay so it's definitely working I mean crazy working so my eyebrows are a little more subtly different this time but I think my lashes look so much longer dang look at that Look at that. <sighs> this freaking works. I'm so excited. So I think I'm going to do maybe... Oh, it's the end of February right now. I'm probably going to go till at least middle March. Maybe I'll push it till the end of March. We'll see. Um, but I'm so excited to show you the end result. It's been... Gosh. It's been at least two months. 
So I think going one more solid month and having a three month process is a really good plan. Cause that's what, 12 weeks? And it's technically my supply is supposed to be eight weeks, but I've already passed eight weeks and I have so much of it left. So um, definitely worth it. Buy the travel size cause it has more product in it than you would think. Let me show you um, comparison pictures from the first check-in, the second check-in and now today. <sighs> this is awesome. Hello friends. Okay, so it's month three, the end of month three, and I'm so excited to finish up this video and show you my progress. I like can't even believe how good this freaking serum works. So let me just show you, get right into it, up close and personal. Look at all of this undergrowth. Look at that. Same thing on this side. Like there wasn't hair there before you guys. I have had so much hair grow in. It's crazy. And I think that in order to get the hair on the underside really full and totally grown in, I'm just going to have to keep using it and keep using it, which is fine by me because it freaking works. And eventually I will get to where I'm hoping to get to a spot where I just don't have to fill my brows in to where they're nice and full, even under here. They have a better like flatter shape under here instead of going like up so much, um, I'm just like so stinking impressed with this freaking progress. Like it's, it's seriously insane. Um, and then my eyelashes have been really great too. I think my eyelashes have been a little bit more of a subtle change just because I was happy with my eyelashes before, but I can definitely tell that they've grown. So without further ado, to wrap up this video, I'm going to put some makeup on my face. I've already put my serums on for the day and I'm going to show you the before and afters of what my freaking eyelashes look like, what my freaking eyebrows look like after three months consistently using these Grande Growth Serums on my brows. Literally, you guys, the before and afters are crazy. Like, I cannot wait to show you the progression of the past three months. <sighs> okay, like seriously, they're so bushy. And look at my eyelashes, you guys. Like, look, look at that. And you know, I don't know if this growth serum works on the bottom too, but my bottom lashes seem a lot longer to me. I don't freaking know, but um, these are my brows filled in. And these are my eyelashes with mascara on them. This stuff works, like it freaking works. And what I like about it is that it's subtle enough that you're not like, whoa, eyebrows. I mean, it's going to take me a little bit to figure out how to perfect filling in my eyebrows now that there's more of them. But look at my eyelashes. What the frick, you guys? So this definitely works. I recommend it. You should totally get it if you want to experiment with growing your lashes or your brows. It works. That's, that's all I have to say. So before we go, let me show you the before and afters from when we first started all the way through month three so that you can see the progression and how amazing this growth serum works. So I'm super happy with the results. I'm going to continue using this and we will see as the months go by how um, happy I am with my brows and maybe I'll reach my goal of just not having to fill them in ever. But I definitely, definitely, definitely recommend the Grande Brow Serums. They for sure work. I love them so much. I've had such a fun time experimenting and kind of shocking myself with the results. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel if you want to see more videos like it. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.